um it's very flavorful um so let's get into that Hey y'all, it's your girl Tierra here and I am back with another video. So today I am going to be making green seasoning. It's very easy, Um, it's very flavorful, um, so let's get into that. So green seasoning is something that I recently started using, I would say about... Like last year, like September ish, um, because my friend um is Spanish, and then my brother's girlfriend, she's Haitian. So like I've tried both seasonings, of course, like seeing them cook with it, and I taste the food or whatever. So I was like, you know what? Why don't I just mix both of them together? Because they're using pretty much the same ingredients except for the herb the one herb that is different is the the cilantro and the parsley so i decided i'm gonna mix them both together and i'm gonna call it my green seasoning so it's in the spanish culture they call it sofrito and in the haitian culture they call it epis so i just call mine green seasoning because i mix them both together so i'm gonna show y'all and walk y'all along too with this um and it's gonna be very quick so grab your blender grab your ingredients and let's get into that all right y'all so i got everything here i got them in my calendar which has it sits over the sink which is great i love that so i just rinse everything off make sure everything is clean um and yeah so we got green pepper red pepper we have green onion we have thyme, we have scotch bonnet, we have parsley and cilantro, okay? I'm also gonna be using vinegar and um, garlic as well. And um, we bought to cut this up. Oh, also an onion. So I have onion um, that I need to chop up. I'm gonna chop this up. It doesn't have to be pretty, you just put, cause it's going right into the blender. So I'm gonna chop this up in the onion and then um, I'm gonna show y'all all that. All right, so I cut up the onion and the green pepper and the red pepper. Um, And now we about to grab this blender and we about to just get everything in it. All right, so I don't have the perfect kitchen. Um, I wish it was a better angle for y'all, but this is the best angle I can give. But I got my blender set up. I have the Ninja Professional Blender. Um, if you wanna check this out, you can check it out on my Amazon storefront. I'll put the link down below. Okay, and y'all, this is the best blender ever. So I got my herbs here. So now I'm gonna add everything into the blender. So I use two onions and I just cut them in four. Um, I'm just gonna start with some of this. So be careful because the blend, the blade for this is very, very sharp. I probably should have added this first. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna. Blend this, let me get the top. So it's more space, so I'm gonna add more. So I'm just gonna be adding a little bit at a time until it's all blended. And then I'll add the vinegar at the end. I use high, you use whatever you want, but I use high. And I'm almost done, cause now is I like mine a little chunky. All right, 
And of course you can use fresh garlic, but I personally don't like to peel garlic. So I always buy minced garlic. So I'm gonna put that in there. Okay. Okay, so this is how chunky it is. I like this consistency. Nice. All right, so it tastes pretty good. I probably should have just used one squash on it. It's a little spicy, but um, it should be okay by the time I actually cook it with food or whatever. But yeah, this is the consistency that I like. It's nice and chunky. Good thing that was over a bowl. But yeah, it's nice and chunky. It's nice and green. It smells amazing. And yeah, so now I'm going to put it in my mason jar. Um, I got this mason jar right here. So I'm going to store it in here. And um, I'll be right back. So now I'm going to pour it in here. So this is the, the green seasoning, y'all. Don't it look great? Let me zoom in for y'all. Let me let me bring it closer. You see how nice and flavorful that looks? So yeah, I got my two jars. I'm pretty sure my friend is gonna want some, Andrea. I'm gonna ask her if she wants some, but um, yeah. So yeah, this is my green seasoning. Um, this is how I make it. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, because a lot of TikTok mommy friends was asking me about um, what is it and how do I make it. So this is how I make it. Um, but yeah, this is the end of this video. If you haven't yet, please like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe if you're new here. I will be posting you know cooking content mommy content and all that good stuff um and comment down below if you use green seasoning but yeah this is the end of the video again i want to thank you guys for watching stay tuned for more and i'll see you guys later bye